What are you doing here? Can't imagine what you must be going through. I know I've been through some bad times, but finding out my mum tried to get rid of me. Get rid? I wasn't a bunch of multiplying cells, I was toddling around. Obviously being a right pain. Oh, whatever, the woman's a psycho, end of. Pete was right. We are all better off without her. It's a real thing, Ross, postnatal depression. Tons of women go through it. You know, maybe even me when I had Sarah. Maybe that's why I couldn't cope, gave her away. It's cos you were a kid. And let's face it, you left her. You didn't try and... ..do that. OK, so it's unimaginable. But if you think I'm going to sit here and judge you, you can forget it. I watched Grandad battle mental illness. Zach, of all people, who'd have thought it? All I'm saying to you is... ..you've got the chance to get to know her properly. And make up your own mind. What have you got to lose? You still feel the same? Then you been her. Your granddad didn't try and kill his kid. <laughs> the brain can do weird stuff. Make you do awful things. Do you buy that degree in psychiatry online or something? Yeah, OK, I read up about it. Because they're my family and I care and I wanted to help and I wanted to understand. And there it is. The difference between you and me. She's not my family. And I don't care. Yes, she is. And yet you do. Ross. Finn thought it'd be best if I went. Your dad wants to talk to your brothers, but... It should be down to you. It's OK, I understand. When you left... ..where did you go? Um, I was in a bad way. Slept rough. Then this copper found me and took me to a hospital. When I got myself together, I went home to your nan and granddad's. I used to come and watch you, make sure that you were doing OK. Yeah, he said. Doesn't make it right. You have no idea how much I hate myself. And you have every right to now. Hey. you. I don't even know you. Stay. But no more post-mortems. There's no point. We'll, uh, Just see how it goes, yeah?